our lifestyle is full of technology and globalization. However, there are places where the modern lifestyle has not been able to reach them just yet. So join us today as we discover the top 10 remote places in the wilderness that people still live. But before we begin, make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notified every day for more amazing content. With all of that being said, let's begin. Number 10, North Sentinel Island. One of the most particular ethnic groups in the world has its home on the North Sentinel Island in the Indian archipelago of Andaman. We call them by the island's name because nobody knows what they call themselves. In fact, almost nothing is known about the Sentinels. Number nine. Papua, Indonesia. The Korowai tribe live in this place. They were found in the 70s for the very first time. They believe everyone would be destroyed by an earthquake if they ever changed their habits. In the end, it's better for us if they stay where they are because, well, they're cannibals. Number eight. The Island of Papua New Guinea. Now this is the home of a diverse group of aboriginal tribes. By the way, they are also cannibals. Some of these tribes have decided to move away from the outside world since the beginning of European colonization. Number seven, the Faroe Islands. Although they officially belong to Denmark, the Faroe Islands have even their own national football team. However, the curious thing about this place is that there are more sheep than people there. Number six, Adak, Alaska. Now you probably think that this is a list of places that nobody knows. Well, you may want to think about that twice. Attic is an Alaskan island with only 300 people separated from big city madness. As you can imagine, traffic here, not a problem. Number five, Bantam Village. In the Indian Ocean, we find the distant Cocos Islands. There's a place there called Bantam Village with a population of 600 people. And if you don't like company or you just want to connect with nature and enjoy beautiful landscapes, then this place is perfect for you. Number four, Svalbard, Norway. Svalbard is an archipelago of islands in northern Norway, a few kilometers from the North Pole in the middle of the Arctic Ocean. So this place is cold. But despite being a frozen tundra, there are about 2,500 people that live there. Number three, Amazon Rainforest. Now this place has some of the most dangerous animals on earth, but it's still the home of a tribe known as the Mashko Piro. They live in the areas belonging to Peru. Historically, the Mashko Piro have rejected outsiders, a determination that allowed them to survive slavery. Number two, Equalit, Canada. About 7,000 people live here, and this place is so isolated that getting there by plane or boat is better than trying to get there by car, given the fact that there's no highway and the road is extremely dangerous. This is also one of the coldest places on earth. And number one, the Brazilian rainforest, the home of a man. A man known as the man in the hole lives in the Brazilian rainforest. He digs huge five meter deep holes in palm huts. Nobody knows what he does with them because these cabins are abandoned as soon as someone ever approaches them.